Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, The Christian Mechanic. I got another uh, tool pickup to go, go over with you guys today that I picked up a while back. I was watching uh, Tony the Technician's uh, channel, and he has always has on there um, like uh, Amazon, like good deals and stuff like that. And I saw this on there. They're, uh, they're stubby, one piece design. They're uh, Impact, or Impact Hex uh, driver set. That I saw on there, uh, 16 piece. Well, anyway, this one right here is made by SunX Tools, and it's a uh, 3/8 drive, and it has both uh, standard and metric inside of it. The part number for this is 3646, and these are lifetime warranty. And it also says this uh, set includes stubby impact hex drives, one fourth. 5 sixteenths, 3 eighths, 7 sixteenths, half inch, 9 sixteenths, 5 eighths, 3 quarter, and then your metric are 6, 7, 8, 10, 12, 14, 17, and 19. And it says M1 blow molded case, which is what it comes in. So that's cool. <clears throat> you come over here. These are a one piece design. They're not, uh, they're not like your usual uh hex drives where they're pressed into a uh, like a socket or whatnot these are all one uh one piece forged out of one piece of metal forged from high quality chromoly alloy steel for maximum durability um pretty much that's it for that let's look take a little quick look at the back here see if we see any other information on here about it um where it's made from i'm looking or where it's uh not where it's made from made in Taiwan so these are made these were made in Taiwan and uh let's go ahead and just slide this off and just take a quick look at it and uh you got your one little your whole your hinge right here is all one piece it's not two little two little pieces that's something I see about the case and then uh this case here you know just feeling it or whatnot it's it's pretty uh hard uh Blim mold case is not flimsy. I know them uh, three quarter inch drive sockets that I had ordered a while back. The, uh, the, the uh, plastic bone mold case is real, real flimsy. You could tell it was cheap. It wasn't. Uh, it wasn't hard like this. I could take my finger and anyway, squeeze it in there. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we're gonna open this up. Um, now I want to go get a Harbor Freight one because I have them close by, and we're just uh, we'll compare that. So here's the 17. This is your standard, uh, you know, size one that where you press it into something. And here's your impact or your stubby. And it's probably an inch, inch and a half, you know, shorter, shorter than it is, uh, shorter than it. Uh, we're gonna take a quick look at this here on the side here. Uh, the broaching. It does have a nice. Uh, Deep broaching onto it, and uh, they do chamfer the edges of the socket going into it. And then, as far as your detents, uh, they do have the one hole here for your detent. There's no other uh, visible markings as far as being stamps or whatever. Uh, nothing stamped. Everything's laser etched. So we do have Sun X. It has the chromoly on there, and uh, your 17 millimeter. Now these have a uh, these do have a part number on there as well. And well, here's the three quarter, just to compare to, and it says three, six, four. So they do, each one is individually uh, labeled with its own uh, part number. So I guess if you um, if you break one or whatnot, you can give them that part number and they'll be able to send you out, you know, a replacement. So, yeah, we, we, we get a little, take a little measurement of it just to give you a, I know I said about an inch, inch and a half or whatnot. These are about an inch. Yeah, they're about an inch thick. Like one and a, and a sixteenth, but we're gonna then your your regular size they're you know, two and five two and two and five eighths, whatnot. So these are definitely a whole lot whole lot shorter and these these would be great for if you were uh working in a tight spot and you uh you can't get your uh, your ratchet down in there you know instead of pulling out an allen key because that's the only thing you can get in there usually uh you know like i said you got your allen key your allen keys are always shorter than this anyway 
instead of getting out your Allen key, you can just uh, go, go grab your impact sockets and you'll be able to get that on there. Even with it attached to, uh, to a ratchet, it's still uh, you know, a good about a half inch shorter or whatnot. The only thing I see here is you got a little bit of uh, got a little bit of anvil play. Now this is a Stanley ratchet. We can try a couple different kinds of uh, kinds of ratchets here. Here's a uh, one of my new gear wrench. That's still still got a little bit of play on it. So that's no. Let me go grab an impact because these are impact sockets. See how they feel on an impact driver. So we're gonna try it on this on this DeWalt hex driver here, and this has got uh this doesn't have a detent. This has just got the hog ring on here, so a little different, but uh that's better. It fits better on a uh, on a driver than it does on a uh, a ratchet, but you can do either one with it. It's no big deal. So. Yeah, they do fit on the uh, impact tools a little nicer than they do, you know, just using it with a, a ratchet or whatnot. Now, these were originally $57, probably with taxes, probably around 60 bucks. but they were on, like I said, these were on sale. It was 40-some per, uh, percent off, so I got them for like, it was 33-something. So I got them for almost half off, so I thought that was a really good deal, and uh you know, just to get a pair, a uh, set of these stubby, uh, stubby uh, sockets is, uh, is was uh, something good you can have. It's always good to have tools where you don't, that you don't have just for that one time when you don't come into that situation where you can't get something doesn't fit just quite right. You know, it's always good to have that special specialty tool that uh, makes your job easier. All right, everybody. Well, I just want to thank you. Um, you know, just uh, leave a comment. A like if you like it. If not, that's cool too. No big deal. I just want to thank everybody and just have a blessed night. Thank you, everybody.